I ended up getting some two by fours from uh, Home Depot here. Uh, they were so wet that it, it, I couldn't have used them. Them to dry out a little bit. Uh, we would let them sit here for a few days since I can't seem to find a garage door anywhere. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a couple. I've already done the mock-up on it. That way I'll have two doors. They'll open outward. Now here you want to be sure you don't have any knots on the end, so go ahead and get those cut out. I've built a lot of these doors like this, uh, mostly for sheds and so forth. But this here is one of the most rigid styles I could ask for. This is the hinge side. So it's gonna pull down on this side. This here will tell it not to and keep it nice and straight for you. And especially when we get the uh, paneling on. Let's go mock it up into the doorway and we'll make sure everything fits right and that we have the seams lined up and so forth. I'll show you that now. Okay. I went ahead and got the door lined in. Got shims. Next is taking the groove and transferring it to here. That way it'll all line up, all the seams.
Okay, once I get the seam lined up, this part to here, I went ahead and put these in on both doors to give this some uh, support. Now I threw this in here just as a block because the hinge will come up here and I want to make sure it gets all the meat I can get on it. So we'll go and get those stuck, stuck in there and get this door done. Well, there we go. Now where it's all set in, we'll go ahead and start putting the paneling on. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and set the door up now. What I did is I put these up here, make sure we line it up. I took it all the way to the top because I know it's gonna sag a little. And in here. So, as you can see the trim, I wanted to line these all the way up. So, now it's putting on the hinges and then we get the other door set in we'll go ahead and get this trim piece on which is going to be on the other door that overlaps So now you see the doors here, we're going to go and get this uh, insulation in. Uh, just like this, we'll go and get it cut out, put it inside the cavities. And what that's going to do is make it nice soundproof. But also, this is going to be a climate controlled building. Okay, one door down. I'm going to go ahead and put skin on this, which is going to be that 8th inch Luan. We're done with the doors other than having to paint them. And we're going to go ahead and stop there and we'll do the seals and all that on another video. But I appreciate you being here. And remember to hit like and share if you could. And I appreciate it if you're not subscribed, maybe take an opportunity to subscribe now. I'll talk to you later.